Hello and welcome to Into Vietnam on SCTV8 VTV. The Ministry of Transport has proposed the government extend support policies for transport firms until the end of the year and offer more support solutions to those facing difficulties caused by the COVID-19 pandemic. As for road transport, the ministry proposed the government extend its support for road maintenance fees that have been reduced by 30% on passenger coaches and 10% on trucks until the end of 2021. It is necessary to offer more support solutions for road transport firms to help them recover after the coronavirus pandemic, including reducing value-added tax to zero and corporate income tax by half and extending debt payment deadlines, according to the ministry's proposal. Other support solutions proposed by the ministry include a 50% reduction on services at coach stations, a 50% cut in registration fees for vehicles used for transport operations, and exemption from parking fees at train stations, seaports, and airports. These cuts should be valid until the end of the year. The Vietnamese shrimp sector is aiming to boast a brackish water shrimp farming area of approximately 740,000 hectares with a total output of 930,000 tons and export turnover of 4 billion US dollars during the course of this year. Currently, Vietnam is home to roughly 200,000 hectares of high-tech shrimp farming, the majority of which is in the two provinces of Bạc Liêu and Sóc Trăng in southern Vietnam. Statistics show with the global shrimp industry averaging an annual growth rate of some 7%. Total global shrimp production is anticipated to reach 50 million tons by 2045. Many industry experts said Vietnam could become the world's leading shrimp producer and accounts for about 25% of the global shrimp market share with an output of 4 million tons by raw shrimp with 20 billion US dollars by 2045. Please keep watching the news clusters. Supporting industries will be a focus of an investment promotion plan released by Central Guangai Province for 2021. It has earmarked close to 2.2 billion Vietnam dong, or 95,500 US dollars, to implement activities to attract investment to local projects in supporting industries, petrochemicals, high technology, seaports, logistics, clean technology, high tech agriculture, urban infrastructure, and tourism and services. Vietnam Airlines is set to expand its domestic flight network between April 24th and August 31st to meet the higher demand during the summer's peak travel season. The national flag carrier will open six new routes Đà Nẵng Vinh, Phú Quốc Cần Thơ, Phú Quốc Nha Trang, Phú Quốc Buôn Mê Thuật, Phú Quốc Huế, and Phú Quốc Thanh Hóa. Till 5 p.m. April the 16th, 2021, Vietnam recorded a total of 2,758 cases of COVID-19 infection nationwide, 2,445 cases recurred, and 36 died. Welcome back to Into Vietnam on SCTV8 VITV. The South Korean tire maker Kumho to invest over 300 million US dollars in its Vietnam plant. Japan's Anshu Railway to build software development units in Vietnam. The Vietnam Furniture Marching Week kicks off in Ho Chi Minh City. That's into Vietnam on SCTV8 VITV. Thank you for watching. Goodbye and see you next time.